Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope that you guys are all doing very, very well. I currently again, 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 I'm sat in the living room filming this video for you guys because I am actually waiting on two very, very important parcels to arrive. So fingers crossed that they are gonna arrive very soon because I am very, very excited for these parcels to arrive. Also, if you can hear the washing machine in the background, I do apologize, but I have obviously just put a wash on, as most of you guys will know. Washing piles just never seem to be ending, ever. So yes, put a nice um, fresh load of washing in. I It is Wednesday today, and I don't normally have a Wednesday off, but I booked today off because obviously with me having these two parcels arriving i thought i'm just gonna book the day off and film a bit of content for you guys and obviously wait in for these parcels to arrive i also do have a few parcels to send off myself as well which i'm going to sort out later on obviously when i have had these parcels arrive that i need to arrive x y and z and I am obviously just sat here in my pyjamas yet again because it is five past eight in the morning. And yeah, my husband has just left for work. So I've already got up, got ready. I haven't got dressed because I can't be bothered to get dressed. So I thought I'm gonna get my camera out and I'm gonna get a head start again on filming some content for you guys because I know the past couple of weeks the content has not been giving and I have kind of been slacking a little bit in regards to upload, uploading, but I've had quite a few issues with the app that I use to obviously edit my videos and get them uploaded. It just has not wanted to work at all. So yesterday I, when I uploaded my, the White Company Primark and Boots haul video, I re-deleted the app and I've restarted from scratch again with the app and yeah, finally managed to get it working. So. I thought that this morning I would sit down and film a little vintage haul for you guys because I feel like I haven't done a vintage haul for so long and I always used to do like the vintage and charity shop hauls. Now we haven't been to a charity shop in forever. Well we have been but we haven't found anything that has taken an interest to either of us so hence why there has been like no charity shop haul videos however i have been ordering a few bits off of vintage and there isn't much but i obviously just have a little haul for vintage things to show you guys so obviously that is what today's video is going to be about so it's basically just everything that i have kind of purchased from vintage in the past week the past two weeks now there isn't a lot at all i think i've got about four items to show you guys but some of the stuff that i have got is absolutely incredible now my favorite list on vintage is absolutely full like every day i go on vintage and i just have a browse i'm forever like hearting things because there's so much on vintage that i could just easily like buy and yeah i absolutely love shopping on vinted so i am basically just going to get straight into it and show you guys everything that i got from vinted and i'm gonna try and remember how much i paid for these and some of these do have like the rrps prices on them um and so i will obviously let you guys know the rrp of these things as well so I'm just gonna get straight into it and show you guys my little haul from Vinted. Okay, so the first thing that I got from Vinted was this Kate Spade Colour Block Pencil Cup. Now this is the packaging that it arrived in. Now obviously the girl said obviously the box was a little bit damaged, but obviously I'm not really gonna need the box at all. So I picked this up um it is a little bit dusty from obviously where it's just been sat and it hasn't been used this makes my face look really weird Ooh. but yes nonetheless this is like a block pencil cup so obviously you can put pencils pens x y and z in here and i just absolutely love the detailing of this i absolutely love this like purple lilac color and then obviously underneath it just has obviously kate spade embroidered into it which i just think is absolutely stunning now i paid 12 pounds for this and the rrp of this 
I'm almost certain that the RRP of this was something ridiculous like 56 pounds or something like that um so that is the first thing that I picked up now excuse me this will come in handy for obviously my desk which you guys wouldn't have seen yet but I am planning on doing a video of that for you guys because I have something very exciting that is going to be arriving today which is just going to complete what I've been sort of looking forward to and sort of working on so this is going to come in very handy to put obviously on my desk so that was the first thing that I brought from Vinted. Okay and then the second thing that I brought from Vinted which I am absolutely obsessed. Now I do not need any more mugs, glasses, cups, I don't need any more of that because I have two cupboards that are full of cups and glasses. Now don't get me wrong, like I do every now and again I will go through them and sort of get rid of the ones that I don't use or that I'm not really liking anymore. Um, but I could not resist buying these. Now these again, obviously from Kate Spade. I told you guys in this Kate Spade video that I did that I've got a bit of an issue now. I think I found a favourite brand. So I picked up these absolutely stunning like glasses. Um, so drinks glasses. And oh my goodness guys, these are just absolutely stunning. And I just instantly fell in love. So this is what they look like. I mean, how gorgeous are those? I just absolutely love the detailing. I love the shape of the glasses. And I have obviously taken one out of the packaging because I absolutely love a Diet Coke. Like, I am obsessed with Diet Coke. And when I tell you that I have sat on the sofa for the past two days with one of these glasses in my hand with a nice cold Diet Coke in it has been absolute heaven. So I paid £20 for a set of four Kate Spade glasses and the RRP of these, so this is in US dollars, so the US dollars of these was $75. Now I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see that. But $75 and I paid £20 for these so I don't really know like the conversion rates or anything like that but still a bargain and absolutely obsessed with these glasses so very excited about these and also these are going to be perfect for like when I have like my mother-in-law and my sister-in-law around because I know for a fact they are going to absolutely love using these so I'm very very excited about that okay and then the other purchase that I made from Vinted. Now, I am not a heel type of girly. I never have been. But I, obviously, when we go out for, for food and stuff, I always feel like my outfit looks really nice, but then I always pair it with, like, my Converse or my night dunks. And I just wanted, like, something nice like a, a lovely pair of heels to go with like my jeans or a nice dress or something like that just to make the outfit feel a bit more complete and I don't actually own a pair of heels now I used to love wearing heels when I was younger and then obviously because I stopped going out I just never bothered to wear heels again because I never really needed to but now I'm trying a new thing where I am going to try and obviously even if I just stick to these one pair because I don't really want a whole collection of heels and stuff because I know that I will never wear them. So I found these absolutely stunning, stunning may I add, Kate Spade heels on Vinted. I mean how stunning are these? Now, I, I'm really not a heel person, but oh my goodness, these are stunning. If I had have found these on my graduation, I would have definitely, most definitely have worn these. I mean, I just absolutely love the bow detailing on these. 
and they are such a comfy shoe it's unbelievable now the heel isn't very big on these which absolutely fine by me because i don't want to be like bambi on ice but these are the perfect heel for me i have tried them on and i have walked around the house in them and i'm obsessed i feel very comfy in them i feel very confident that i'm not going to fall over or break an ankle because obviously as you guys will know i did have that ankle injury last year at work and obviously my foot has not been the same since so i didn't want to risk getting anything that is not going to be beneficial for me so these are just absolutely stunning now i paid 25 pounds for these and the rrp of these was 212 pounds and i paid 25 pounds and the girl who i brought these off was absolutely she was so lovely she was so kind and she was so nice and i am just over the moon with these gorgeous gorgeous heels very happy with those okay and then the final thing that i have purchased from vintage which i actually collected yesterday um so it just came in this sort of box and i obviously i don't know i don't really know why I, I well i know why i brought it but it's one of those things where i was like hmm so i managed to find a whole selection of bath bombs that were being sold for three pounds now i'm an absolute sucker for bath bombs and i feel like in certain places bath bombs have become so expensive and so i obviously typed in bath bomb bundle and it came up with so many bath bombs and so i just thought you know what i'm just gonna buy them and i kid you not guys there must be about 15 different bath bombs in here so obviously just got like a little penguin one um we just have this like rainbow colored one there is then a little pig in here um we have loads of these like little star ones which are stunning so we have loads of them in here there is some like christmasy styled ones so there's obviously this like christmasy stocking fizzer we have a, a gingerbread man one now i do always buy these in like christmas time however guys he has arrived a little bit broken but nonetheless it still works the same she then also put in some um shower steamers so obviously you just put these on the side of the shower when you're having a shower and the when the water hits it obviously it creates a scent absolutely incredible then we just have a few like plain white ones as well um again some more some more of the heart ones uh, star ones sorry and then we just have a smiley face one so most of the bath bombs are sort of like replicas but for three pounds honestly guys absolutely it's just an absolute bargain because if i'd have gone into the shop to purchase all of these this probably would have cost me at least 15 pounds so for a whole box of bath bombs you really cannot go wrong so yeah that is everything that i have purchased from vinted in the last week or so now there probably will be another video on stuff that i have purchased from vinted um, because i just cannot control myself on vinted i absolutely love that website and yeah so that is basically today's whole video for you guys now i hope that you guys enjoy this video i know i haven't got many items to obviously show you but nonetheless it's always nice to share these things with you guys and let you guys know what i've been up to what i've been purchasing because i know you guys are very very invested in like the things that i buy and stuff so it's always nice to sit down and film these videos for you guys and yeah that will go ahead and obviously conclude today's video so as always i hope that you guys have enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and obviously don't forget to subscribe if you did enjoy this video and 
I hope you guys have a lovely week, whatever you are doing, whether you are spending it with friends, spending it with family, if you guys are working or if you are off of work. I obviously just hope that you guys have a fantastic week and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.